Hello everyone, and welcome back to my channel. It's great to have you here. So this painting is my second out of three for the 5x5 project with a Ben Gallery in Denver. And in this piece, titled Momentary Breath, I wanted to capture the peaceful quiet after a fresh snow. And as I typically like to do with my landscape paintings, I first started with the sky in the background. And after that, I started to block in the trees in the background. And with most of these trees and bushes, I chose to start with the darkest color that I could see in the shadows, and then build up mid-tones and highlights from there. And for me, the key to this piece was building up layers over time of different textures and colors to show depth. And most of the colors in this piece were in some proximity to ultramarine blue, but there definitely was some variety with some greens and browns. And in this portion of the painting, you can see me going into the textures of the leaves. And I was trying to leave the bright textures of the snow for the last portion of the painting. And you can really start to see with these textures and highlights that these trees start to take shape and they really settle into the landscape nicely. And soon you'll start to see me work on the foreground, which was just some scattered grass that was frozen over. But again, these small textures and line work really contribute to the depth in the painting. And probably the last big component to this piece was this snow cover, which was my brightest highlights in the piece and thickest textures. And after some final details and adding my initials to the corner, we have our final product. And I specifically wanted to film myself holding this painting just so you could see how small it was, but still packed with a lot of life. And I think a big thing that this 5x5 project has taught me is to really value these smaller paintings, because they're not only a great opportunity to try new things, but they also give you that strong sense of accomplishment and reward after finishing a project. I suppose that these smaller paintings started to teach me that not every painting has to be a gigantic project that takes months to complete. And overall, I really enjoyed making these smaller pieces, so I could see myself doing them in the future as well. And I'm really happy to say that this painting has been sold, but if you do want to see prints available, then let me know in the comments and I can get back to you on that. But that's about it for now. So thank you for watching, I really appreciate it as always. If you want to view this piece or more of my work, you can go to my website, which is austinhowlett.com. And be sure to stay tuned for the process video of my final painting that's a part of this show. Thank you.